What's up, guys? My boss saying, as you guys see, we got ourselves some ultimate legends that are in the game. We got ourselves two new NFL honors in the game right now as well with Josh Allen and Aaron Donald. We got ourselves some new training packs that we got to check out as well. How you get yourself a free uh, ultimate legends card. But before we get into that, please do me a favor. Drop a like. Hit the sub. Turn on notifications. Because to be honest, this is my third time doing this. So the first time that we tried opening packs so we can see if we can get something though. Didn't go as planned, and the second time, though, my mic wasn't even on. So, yeah, you can tell I'm having a great day. But right now, let's go over to this. So, the solos that came out. First, we're going to look at the Ultimate Legends release. Because with this, they're full games. Yes, they are. But, let's say, like, um, let's go to Isaac Bruce, for example. All you got to do is just play it on one star, drain the clock, and win. You get their power up. It's that simple. Just like normal Legend Solos. We got us Isaac Bruce, Randall Cunningham, Corey Dillon, Stephen Hutchison, Travis Frederick, Harry Carson, Brian Dawkins. We got Thomas, Nam Niasawa, and Mean Joe Green. Those are all the Ultimate Legends that came out today. We also got ourselves the Ultimate Legend Kickoff Token. You play this solo again. One star, full game. You don't got to do everything. All you worry about is getting the one star. And what you can do with that, you have to do that for the next 15 uh, weeks or the next 15 times that solo comes out. That's going to be one time every week when the new ones come out because you can go to the sets. And when you do that, you can add it to this exchange set and you will get yourself a free, random, full Ultimate Legend card. Now, Another thing I like is this, though, for example. Like, say if you have, like, let's go for Nani, for example, right? Because that's the card I want to bring to my team. If you have random legend pieces that's in your binder, don't don't worry about it. Because you can just throw them right here. Because you need three 85 to 86 overall legend pieces and six 83 to 84 legend pieces. And you will get yourself a random 87, 91, or 95 overall skill position of that player that you're doing. And for specifics, you can do that which is honestly a good thing like maybe you can try to make some coins out of it as well we pull the 95s because yeah we go with the 95 say for example for nomni that's 530 bro that's an easy 500k so pretty much the 95s of the full ultimate legends is what you're looking for if you're trying to packs besides obviously the your honors cards and also apparently the animations rings that i've seen i've seen the animation it looks dope though but we're looking for some uh for some rings but before we do that, here are the training things I was talking about. This is an 83 plus legend player for 2600 training. I believe we can pull full legends out of these. I haven't seen anything yet. Every time I've done one of this, it's just that. And it's like an 83 or an 85. So I throw that right into training and I'll move on with my life. But this one right here is more intriguing. This, this, uh, what is it? this variety pack. I don't know why I couldn't get the word out. But <laughs> what it gets, you can get yourself a power player. A 90 plus Redux, an 83 plus Legend player, an 82 plus Team of the Week player, or a coin quick sell or an alternate uniform. If you guys want me to maybe spend like 50,000 training opening 25 of these packs, let me know in the comments because I would have loved to try this out and see what you get. Because just to show you guys that we will open up one. And just for an example, we got 1,000 coins. That is the worst thing we're going to pull, so I'm honestly going to try that again. Before I open up the bundle, I want to try that again. Because also with these Ultimate Legend packs, what I've seen from them is that it's honestly not that good. We got ourselves a power up, Merlin Humphrey. Let's go one more, why not? But one more. The first time I did this thing was off camera. I got 20,000 coins, and we got ourselves another power up. Larry Tunsil. Like, can you stop giving me these, these power ups? Like, come on. Obviously, the best thing you pull is either like high quick, uh, quick sells or a Redux that's a 90 plus. But. Right here, this is where we're opening up the nine Ultimate Legend Packs and the 87 Toppers. So let's open these things up. See what we get. Maybe we got ourselves some rings. But nah, from what I've seen, y'all, on Twitter and what I've heard, these packs are not that good. So before you think about getting them, use me as the training dummy as we got ourselves an 87 overall right there. And also, I don't know if you guys will notice this too, uh, too but watch the animation though. You can see what you're getting right there. We got the fullback 91, Corey Dillon. Like, I already saw it on the second in the form of it. Like, really? That ruins the fun. You know what I'm saying, though? It, like, ruins the fun. Like, it's like, oh, cool, we got some ultimate legend piece. 
Where are them rings at though? Look, another 91. It's the same car. So I'm just gonna fly through this thing. Nothing else. Next. Let's see what else we can get right now. I'm looking for an honest card, and I'm honestly looking for maybe a full ultimate legend. If you can pull these things out of packs, I don't even know if you can, but if you can't, let me know. But I'm looking for rings right now. So that's another Corey Dillon. Even if we don't pull the full ones though, a 95 overall will be perfect. Because those things go for a nice chunk of change. So that's honestly what we are looking for right now. No rings, an 87 overall. Now you see what? First of all, let's end Travis Frederick. Why not D-Tap? That's interesting. That's just interesting to me. But let's see what else we got though here. We got Brad McDougal. We got Chris Jones. That's us once again another one, but the 91 Isaac Bruce. If you guys want Isaac Bruce on something, y'all let me know in the comments. I'll maybe we'll give him a shot. Because Isaac Bruce, I haven't seen him like Madden 16, the signature card. And that card was good for a long time. That card was good for a long, long time. I'm getting no rings. But we're getting ourselves a 91, which is okay. That's like 30, 40k. But it's pretty much a 95 or a limited or a full. That's pretty much what you're looking for. And I haven't seen a single ring yet or a high animation. I'm just getting these low, low animations. Five toppers, that's what we got left. Let's see if we can maybe get something, uh, 87 plus. Maybe we can get something cool. But it's an 87 already starting, yo. Another low tier nominee. Like, yo, these packs so far are not even worth the time. They're not worth the money, nothing. So if I was you guys, I would not even waste my time with these packs. I mean, we're getting 91s, that's cool. But, yo, you already see it, yo. Keep in mind, this is the second time I'm doing this. I tried earlier and they were trash. So, you can already see it. Another 91 Corey Dunn. So, with that, we got ourselves no limiting. We got ourselves no full Ultimate Legends. I'm just probably close to even doing one of them. And just, just for curiosity. I've seen Corey Dillon's card over and over. Let's see if we're close to even completing them. I mean, yeah, we still need three of the 87s and then the 95 overall. How much is that going for? Only 144? Eh, that's okay. It's not that bad. Maybe we can try and get him, though, get some gameplay with him. And the other card I want to look at, though, is Isaac Bruce. Let's see how we're looking with that. Uh, same thing, but we're going to need some more. But then, obviously, the man we need is Nani Asamoa. We got none of his 91s, just his 87s. And that's how much his 95 is. So pretty much that would be the goal there. Now Omni though is stupid expensive right now. But let's go head over to the auction house. Let's go over these cards and see what they're looking like. And the new uh, NFL honors. I'm going to try to be brief though with them. Since there are a decent amount. So let's see what we got. Looking for the 97 overall. Again, if there's a certain one you guys want to gameplay play with. Let me know in the comments below where are they at. And here we go. The first one is Corey Dillon. He's the cheapest one. He's going to have himself 93 speed, 94 excel, 91 agility, 97 carry, 70 catching, with 91 chain direction, 92 trucking, with 95 break tackle. Uh, cards are right, though. I feel like there's a lot better cards, though, um, for like break tackling and all that, though, when it comes to um, comes to a running back like Bo Jackson and stuff like that. But if you guys are rocking a Bengals team, I can definitely see it. Here's the next one. Travis Frederick, the beard. 95 strength. He's got 95 awareness. 96 pass block. 96 pass block power. 95 pass block finesse. 97 run block. 96 run block power. 96 run block finesse. Best center in the game. That's exactly what he is. And I'm honestly thinking about bringing him. Even though I do have uh, my Patriots and uh, Dinah's theme team. Might have to figure out a way to get the last Patriot, but we'll see. Here's the next card, Harry Carson. He's got himself 92 speed, 93 excel, 91 strength, 95 tackle, 95 play record, 96 blushing, 97 hip power, 91 zone. This card's actually not that bad. It's honestly good. I like it, but middle linebackers don't work in this game. Middle linebackers, for some reason, do not work in this game. Now, here's one you know past rushing goons from day one. I'm not sure how to say his first name. Um, but anyway, we got ourselves tied right here, right here with 91 speed, 93 excel, 90 strength, with 96 tackle, 94 play rec, 
Nine to five blocks. Yeah, with eight. Uh, yeah, eighty finesse move with, with ninety six power move. This is one of the original pass rushers though from back in day one though that just dominated the field. So I can only imagine that card there. Now the next one that came out though is Mean Joe Green. He's gonna have himself uh, speed, 90 XL, 96 strength, with 96 tackle, 95 player, with 96 block shot, with 97 power move, and 82 finesse move. Not that bad of a card, really. More of a power rusher, though. But me, I like Warren Sapp better. And I like uh, DeForest Buckner, though, just as a fast defensive tackle in itself. Uh, let's see. Who we got left? Uh, we got Steve Hutchinson. We got Brian Dawkins. And then the two most expensive ones would be Isaac Bruce and Nani Asamoa. Randall Cunningham's going for? Wow. Cunningham's going for a mill? Wow, let's look why. Here's Randall Cunningham going for like a mill. 93 speed, 97 throw power with 94 short, 91 mu, and 95 deep, 9 throw under pressure, 97 on the road with 9 foot play action. And now I see why. He get, he probably gets Hot Round Master. He definitely gets Escape Artist. He gets uh, Gunslinger. And he probably gets Dash and Deadeye. He's probably one of the best QBs right now in the game. That's Or is the best QB until Michael Vick comes out. So there's my answer to that. Let's see. Here's Brian Dawkins. He's going to have himself 94 speed, 95 excel with 94 tackle, 96 play rec with 95 pursuit, uh, 83 man, 95 zone with 96 hit power. Brian Dawkins, Weapon X. I like him. That car looks really, really good. We might have to make an adjustment for that. But again, though, um, I'm going to go over Nomni and then we'll head over to the. I uh, know, oh, we got Isaac Bruce. What am I saying? Here's Isaac Bruce, 95 speed, 93 jump, with 97 catch, 96 catch and travel, 96 spec, with 94 short, 95 medium, 97 deep. Card's not that bad. It's I honestly do like it. But that's the only thing with a theme team, dude. I feel like this card's all I want to bring to the team. And I feel like that can limit it. So let me know in the comments, should I still go with the two theme team I have, or should I try and make like a best team? Like have a theme though, but make the best team possible. Here's the final card of the Ultimate Legends. We got Nam Niasa with 94 speed, 95 Excel, 94 agility with 95 jump, 95 player with 97 man, 94 zone with 96 press. Best, one of the best corners in the game right now, man. Card it looks really, really good. And I said in my last video that I want to try to bring him to the team. So hopefully we can do that. But he's the second most expensive card right now besides Randall Cunningham. But we'll see what happens. Now, the final two cards we'll be going over today will be Josh Allen, limited time NFL honors. He will have 99 throw power, 90 speed, 94 short, 93 medium with 92 deep, 92 under pressure, 97 on the run, and 92 play action. Again, these strong arm mobile QBs are really, really good, and they're definitely the way to go in this game if you like moving around, but you want a guy that can get Gunslinger along with Hot Route Master. Now, the final card I'll be going over today is Aaron Donald. In my opinion, though, the defensive player of the year should have been TJ Watt, but I'm just leaving it there. Nine, he's got 93 XL, 84 speed, 98 strength with 93 tackle, 96 play right with 97 block shed, 96 power with 94 finesse move. I mean, I'm not going to lie. The card's really, really good. But I'm just saying, in my opinion, I would want to be TJ over Aaron Donald. That's just me. But anyways, that's going to do it for me. That is all the cards that I came out of today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys pulled any Ultimate Legends, if you want to see anything with the team, let me know in the comments below because I'll show you quickly, though, before I get out of here. This is the offense, and this is the defense. We are rocking on this team. We have ourselves a Niners and Patriots type theme team. So if you guys think I should change this to maybe like back to maybe just the Niners, maybe I should just do just the Raiders and just do stuff like that, let me know in the comments or should I just leave it like this? So because the team's not that bad, I do like it, but it's just so we can show off more cards. So let me know that, about that in the comments. If you guys did enjoy, let me know by dropping a like, hit the sub, turn on notifications so you guys do not miss the video. Find me on Twitter, my link will be in the description below. Gameplay will be up later. Hope everyone has a great day. And I'm out, guys. I'll catch y'all in the next video.